Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing a bit of an experiment. We are testing out whether or not uh, connecting to an external monitor hampers graphics performance. So we're going to go through a couple of tests, actually just one test that stresses the graphics card and we're going to see whether or not that affects the uh, performance of that test when we, you know, connect to an external monitor. Uh, to ensure that all the results are the same, we are going to be keeping at a uh, steady frame rate or a constant frame rate of, uh, yeah, these frame rate, uh, temperature, now, uh, fan speeds, thank you brain for working. Uh, so you can probably hear the fans starting to spin up now. I'm not going to be recording while I am stress testing, but I'll show you the results. So, uh, the test we're going to be using today is the Haven benchmark, which is similar to the Valley benchmark, which I love to use, but it's a bit more demanding. We are going to be running at these settings, so if you want to recreate this at home, you can, uh, you can go ahead and do that. And that would be it for the introduction, so I'll see you when we have the results. So, as you can see, using uh, just a single screen without being attached to a, a separate monitor, we got a score of uh, 1008 using the settings you uh, saw in the beginning. So, uh, let's exit out of this. Let's just go out and let's plug in a monitor. Let's just see if I'm recording first. I am. Fantastic. Let's see if the recording uh, becomes a bit crazy after I plug in the HDMI cable. Let's see here. Well, I certainly have to change one thing uh, and that is to go in here and change this to uh, let's expand. There we go. So now, are we recording correctly? We are actually recording screen number two. Yep, we are. All right, that's going to be a challenge. Well, well, I'm not going to record the test anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Let's go back. This is disorienting. Uh, there we go. All right, so this is the test with the screen attached, and I'm running the test on the laptop monitor, so it's not going to be the one you see right now. Um, but you're not going to get to see it anyway. All right. All right. So this was using the uh, uh, external monitor attached, and we played it just on one screen. We will be duplicating the screens next. Uh, but we actually got a higher score uh, with an average frame rate of 40.4. Now I would like to inform you guys that this is within the margin of error. So uh, I think I can quite safely say that having an external monitor attached but only playing the application on one screen does not really hamper performance. So let's uh, quit this and let's go uh, into duplicate mode and let's see if our OBS recording freaks out. So uh, screen settings and duplicate the screens and use that setting. Let's keep and are you recording? You are. Fantastic. All right. So I'm going to test it uh, like this and see if we get a higher or lower, um, I guess, frame rate. Thank you. All right, guys. I actually discovered something uh, irritating, if I can say it that way. The benchmark won't actually run on uh, dual screens. It just freaks out and, uh, yeah, it doesn't want to work. And I think it's because I have multi-monitor disabled. Uh, but I don't really know which setting to put it at. So I think I'm just going to end off this video by saying that no, you do not lose performance by connecting to an external monitor, though I would like to have something more to prove that with. 
So that's it guys. I'm gonna leave you with this uh, wonderful gameplay footage from X Rebirth and uh, I'll see you in the next one.